Number one, what is language learning gravity? Number two, how filling your brain with a new language helps you to communicate in your target language fluently. Number three, what are the benefits of repetition? I'm going to talk about these three points in this video. Let's kick in. Welcome to the Life is Green. Language learning gravity is that you keep learning. You keep taking input, language input, but you feel sometimes that, okay, you are still, your learning, your going up is very slow, like this. Here, this is your level of learning a new foreign language or second language, and you, you have to reach up to here. So this is fluency level, and you are here, but you just learn bit by bit, bit by bit, and you also keep forgetting. You also keep forgetting some of the new structures in a language that you need to communicate easily and confidently in English. That is why you are here and this is gravity. This is gravity. You are struggling with the new language. You want to go up to the fluency level up to here, but you are here and this is gravity. It's, it does not let you go up very fast quick so it is a slow process and you just learn bit by bit some expressions some phrases some new grammar structures new vocabulary words and many new senses in a new language it does not let you go up like like this okay smoothly but it's a little hard for you so when you keep learning it takes time why is it this gravity because you are learning a new language this gravity process leads to number two filling your brain now you are filling your brain it's a slow process and sometimes you forget those structures expressions it's it's slow but when you when you reach here so you are free from gravity and you forget some expression not all of them so in that way now you are free from gravity you feel easy whatever you listen to read consume language content it makes you easy for you because now you are free from the gravity learning a uh, language gravity while in your listening speaking reading writing pronunciation grammar vocabulary in whatever sense you want to think of a language fluency so now you feel easy confident as I mentioned on uh, number two is filling your brain you are uh, you keep filling your brain okay then you go up your brain is an empty water glass you keep filling it and it you are not fluent until it outflows water from that empty water glass okay the water outflows then it means language outflows out of your brain now you are kind of feeling fluent confident in the language delivery number three repetition repetition is key to language fluency because you get input through that listening reading whatever you consume in your target language so in that way you keep filling your brain revising those input through social media through listening to news reading articles magazines listening to podcasts audiobooks and many ways that you need are you are reading your emails i am talking here input repetition input repetition here means that you just consume the language target language content information english language information you keep consuming again and again it's called language input repetition in that way when your brain is full with language information then you are able to communicate in english in your or any other target language you feel confident therefore these three points are interconnected they are interrelated with each other in terms of learning a language filling your brain and language learning gravity makes it like it uh, takes a little time then you take input 
रिपीटिव रिपीटेटिव इनपुट इन दैट वे वैन योर ब्रेन इज फुल देन यू फील ईजी एंड कॉन्फिडेंट इन वाइल कम्युनिकेटिंग विद अदर पीपल दिस इज बी नुसरत हुसैन फ्राम लाइफ स्किल्स ग्रीन सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो